Hello and welcome to Martin Maths. We're doing paper folding with shapes. And my guest presenters are going to help me show me how to fold them and firstly name them. What's this one? Rhombus. The rhombus. And who's, who's making that one for us? Uh, me. Great, so we'll see that in a second. Uh, this one is the? Pentagon. Pentagon. There we go. This one is the? Equilateral triangle. Equilateral triangle. This one is the? Isosceles. Isosceles. And that one is the? Kite. Great. So we're going to start off firstly with the isosceles. So let's start off as we'd get it. We'll just get a nice, say, A5. In this case, A5 could be A4 piece of paper. What would we do? Fold it here. So we're taking the top left corner right to the edge there. And then fold the bottom left corner up along that edge. And there we go. Isosceles triangle. Oh, uh, two sides uh, equal and bottom corners equal. Fantastic, that's the isosceles triangle. Next is the equilateral triangle. Right, so again, if you start off with uh, an A5 or A4 piece of paper, mm -hmm. could you talk me through what you had to do there? So you would first fold your paper in half. Okay. Then open it out again. Yeah. And you would take um, the corner and then fold it in. Fold it into that crease you had in the middle, yeah? And then fold it in again. So you've taken that side edge along that edge, Fold it over that little corner. Brilliant. And then you get an equilateral triangle. Sorry, maybe it's neater that way, yeah. And what makes an equilateral triangle? All the sides are? Equal. Brilliant. Okay. Uh, next was the kite. Okay, so again, if we started with an A5 or A4 piece of paper, could you talk me through that, please? Okay, fold it across there. So the corner to that line there. Okay, brilliant. And then we get a kite. And what makes it a kite? Those adjacent sides are equal. Two pairs of adjacent sides equal. Brilliant. Thank you very much. And next we had the rhombus. What? So again, starting off with that uh, sheet of paper, what do we have to do? So first you have to fold it in half. Yeah. And then you have to fold it in half again. Brilliant. And then once you've um, done that, you flatten it back out. Just bring a bit more, yeah. You fold um, so the, your paper to the quarter point. So the corners to the quarter points, yeah. And then you do the same on the other side. Great. And then you fold this across. So the, the whole edge lines up against there. Yeah. Yeah. And then... Yeah, so then that edge goes on the other side as well. Yeah, so then you fasten it like this and you have a rhombus. Brilliant. And what makes it a rhombus? It has four. All the sides are? Equal. Like a square, but no right angles. Great. Last one. Last one to do now is the pentagon. If you could talk me through this one, please. So you fold the bottom left corner to the top right corner. So corner to corner. And then you fold it the same over from the Again, other so the other corners, corners, yeah. Open it back out again. And then you just fold in those last two. And then you've got a pentagon. And how many sides does a pentagon have? Brilliant. If you could just show me those shapes again. And there we go. That's paper folding, making those shapes. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and share. And goodbye from all.